Hi! Ah, 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 you can't use a sword! Sensei Dan, he's using a sword! No swords, guys. Brian, are you sure about getting neutered? I am. You've seen everything George Townsend's accomplished. That's the life I've always dreamed of. Yes, but how much do you really know about him? Have you read his books? Of course I've read his books. They changed my life. Look, Stewie, this is a huge step for me, and if you can't support me, well, then maybe I should cut you out of my life, too. Brian, that's a closet. I know. I have stuff to do in here. Well, nothing left to do but binge watch Ken Burns' History of Jazz. What? The rhythmic drums of the Congo. 300 years later, Charlie Bird Parker. But how did we get there? Oh. Lois, what are you doing here? Did someone die? Do I get to go home early? Well, Peter, since you were having that jeans fun, I thought it might be fun to come by and sell some of my homemade jewelry to your coworkers during lunch. What? Lois, you can't do that. Once a guy's wife sells something in the break room, no one ever looks at him the same. Two years ago, Bentley's wife made him hang a sign-up sheet to sponsor her in an AIDS walk, and we've hated him ever since. Don't look at me, Bentley. Well, Peter, all you have to do is say you like my haircut, and I'll leave. Never. Suit yourself. Everyone, I'm Peter Griffin's wife. I took a jewelry making class last month with a group of preschool moms, and now I'm gonna do it as a career. Hey, you want a half of my sandwich? Oh, yeah, very cool, Bentley. Who made this? My wife. Oh, you, your wife with AIDS? She doesn't have AIDS. She did a walk for people with AIDS. Presumably, there were people who had AIDS at the walk. Yeah, but you can't get... Yeah, it's a no on the sandwich, Bentley. Greetings, Lois. Oh, my God, Peter, you're gonna make me vomit. Yeah.